Hi everybody, I'm back and today's video is going to be the about a year ago tag and I was tagged by Ko Sushong so thank you for tagging me. This is actually my take two video of trying to attempt this because the first one I accidentally deleted. <laughs> Anyways, uh, the biggest accomplishment of 2014 for me would be um, getting a better job. I, during the fall, I got this job to be a secretary at a Lutheran school, which is really exciting for me because I never thought that I would be able to work in an office. Question number two is the best memory of 2014. The best memory for me for 2014 is being able to talk to my younger brother because me and my younger brother, we haven't talked or seen each other for the past... 17 years and it was just really shocking to know that I was able to talk to him Facebook and Skype and snapchat and all that crazy things so yeah and then um, number three is the biggest obstacle 2014 for me it, I would have to say it was my health because um, a couple years ago I lost a lot of weight and I went from 105 to 110 from there down to 88 pounds and 92 pounds and like my weight just kept gaining and dropping and um, I was just so insecure about it and knowing that I'm able to like bring my weight back up um, it's just really shocking to me that um, cuz I was it wasn't because I was having an eating disorder but it was because I guess it was due to stress and for the year 2014 I stopped stressing and I just realized that I gained a lot of weight from it well not not a lot but like better than how I used to be so number four is top five beauty products and I actually I actually brought the products here so I can show you guys my first one is actually the naked three oh pff, naked three the naked two basic I actually don't even like the naked three I like regret buying that but anyways this is my naked basic two and I really like this um what I like about this is it's really small and I can carry it wherever I go um it has a mirror here that I can like see myself and then um I just really like all the colors in here it just really blends really well with my skin and I also really like this NYX skin press powder um it has a mirror on top here too and then it has this little sponge that I would carry with me and just kind of like tap it on my face if I don't have like a brush but I kind of almost paint off this palette too for this pressed powder. I'm going to apply this on right after I um, apply my liquid foundation. I don't know why, but it's a habit for me. And then next is this NYX eyeshadow base. I really like this one. If you guys watch my tutorial, you guys know that I use this a lot. Um, this one is the ESB03. And I have used a lot of this, but um, I kind of like moved on to the Too Faced primer. And then next is this Maybelline New York IA Studio. I was inspired by Paint 4 tour to, uh, or Makeup by Paint 4. Makeup by Paint, yeah, th that's her YouTube name. Um, so I saw that she did a updated tutorial of her eyebrow using this Maybelline uh, Eye Studio gel liner and I just really like it and so I decided to use this. My last one would be this Wet n Wild Nude Lipstick. I really like this one. Um, it blends in really well with my skin tone. This one is a uh, 902C Bear It All. <laughs> and then 
number seven was regrets of 2014. For me, the regrets that I have is being really mean to my parents because, I don't know, my parents, they kind of like do things that I don't like and I take it really personal and I just kind of like blow off of being really mean to them. And so I really regret that. Uh, memorable phrase of 2014, for me, I would have to say, oh my gosh. And I don't know why, but I always say that. And I still do. I still use that daily. Like, oh my gosh, are you serious? Most embarrassing moment of 2014, for me, it was when me and my brother went to Beauty Max, which is a beauty store down the block from us. And I walked in there and I was checking out some of the wigs. And then, um, when me and my brother walked out of the store, the security guard told me to take off the wig. And I was like, this is my real hair. Like, because I, I had like really long hair. And so, he was like, he was like, no, take it off. And I was like, what do you mean? This is my real hair. Okay, and then, um, lesson learned from 2014. One of the lessons that I learned from 2014 is, um, never ever take online class in the middle of a course because what happens is they just kind of mess up all of your credits and make you go back into, um, like, make you kind of start over the whole entire class over again. So, it took me forever trying to get this online class done, which I'm still currently trying to. Goals for 2015. One of my goals for 2015 is um, to save money because I am a shopaholic and I shop a lot. Even if I don't go shopping at the store physically, I would do online shopping, which is really bad. And then I also I am also trying to gain at least 20 pounds of muscle weight because I am only 92 pounds and well the last time I checked I was like 96 but I gain weight and drop gain and drop so I don't know we'll see and yeah that's my goal is to gain some muscle weight and then number 12 is what I'm looking forward in the year 2015. 2015, I am looking forward to finishing my online courses and whatever else God has planned for me. So, yeah. Anyways, um, that's the last question. And I'll be tagging Little Nunu, um, Gabriella, Brittany, Makeup Diva Queen, and Pink Meaningful. So, I hope that you guys do do this type video. And I know that it's really late. Yeah, thank you for watching my video. And I'll talk to you guys in